What is going on guys? Check out madmobilecoins.com for some of the fastest and cheapest coins out there and use my code ELITE for 10% off. Alright guys, so it is time for me to open up the 20 times Thanksgiving bundle. Um, I generally, I knew I was going to do this because earlier on in the Mad Mobile season I said that I'm going to open up the bundles. The only bundles that I'm going to open this year are holiday themed promos and I'm sticking with that. I think it's fun to open up the holiday promos. Uh, but that's it. I'm not doing anything else. I'm not wasting my money on any of the other crap bundles that EA has. Uh, but for the holiday ones, I think this is going to be fun. So let's jump into the Thanksgiving pack bundle. There's 20 of them. Um, so each one of these contains one gold or better Thanksgiving player. And there we go, Jameson Crowder. And they contain four gold or better players. And we randomly get a pro pack collectible, which is sweet, I guess. Um, and then the topper of this thing contains two elite Thanksgiving players. So I can't wait till I get to that. Uh, so there we get a random side of mashed potatoes plus a Nate Allen and a Dan Bailey. Oh my gosh, this pack is is insane. The Dan Bailey is awesome because he goes in the elite player trading set, uh, which is good because I plan on doing at least 10 of those packs later on today. Uh, there we go, Dante Moncrief, another player in the set. I like it. As long as I'm getting players that go into that set, it's good. I'm liking it. So, all right, let's look for some. If I can get one elite, not that kind of elite, which is good. I like that. Um, but if I can get one Thanksgiving Elite, I'd go insane. There's another Moncrief, but that was honestly a good pack. But one Thanksgiving Elite, I would freak out. That would be insane. Um, Matthew Stafford. Again, I'm pretty sure the 84 overalls, all of the 84s go in the set. So an 84 like that is a good pull plus a Brandon Cooks. Man, this is a good pack. 83s all over the place. 82, 84, so not a bad one there. And we're getting close to being halfway through already, which is kind of terrifying because we haven't pulled anything too crazy yet. Um, so there's another decent one, Anthony Hitchens. These players that don't go in the set only go for about 20k, so they don't go for a whole ton. Nice, there's a random Des Bryan pull. Nice, Chris Ivory. I like it, alright. Um, now in case you guys were wondering about the whole Thanksgiving promo, personally, I, I like it obviously, but I think it's a little weak so far. There's a nice William Gay. Uh, but I think it's weak, like, I really wanted something like a cornuc cornucopia pack, but uh, there's none of that, and I don't know, there's only six sets to complete for this whole entire promo currently, and I just really hope that they add more right around Thanksgiving, because, I don't know, six sets? I'm pretty sure BCA had more than that, and I mean, it's that was BCA, this is Thanksgiving, so I mean, this is like one of the biggest promos, Like thank it's like Christmas, and then Thanksgiving, like, those are the two big ones. And the fact that they're, they only have six sets for it, that just seems kind of low to me. Um, so hopefully they they uh, they boost it up a little bit. Sort of like they did with the Halloween promo. They gave it like a second boost halfway through it. Hopefully they do that. Because I uh, I feel that, or my personal opinion is that it needs it. Uh, but we'll see. E we'll see what EA does. Um, but as we keep spamming through these, these 20 Thanksgiving packs, there's another Dan Bailey. Nice. Um, but there, I'm pretty sure there, there, I think there's one of those gold players that go for a ton of coins. Nice, a Rashad Jones, a Matt Stafford right next to it. That is a good pack. Nice, alright, so that was actually one of the most, the, one of the better packs I've had in the opening so far. Um, what are we gonna get? We got a Tracy Porter, that's a new pull. Um, but other than that, that track, that pack was garbage. Look at that, Ryan Miller's face right now. That is, that just sums up the pack, so. <laughs> oh man, that, that is... That is a horrible picture of Ryan Miller, but hey, hey, he earned his way there. So, this is Deshaun Jackson. What else do we get? Do we get a Glover, a Glover Quinn? So that's, oh, pfft. this pack is full of Thanksgiving goodness. Smash potatoes, a Quinn, and a Deshaun Jackson. Nice. So, pretty full pack there. None of it's overly good, uh, but there was a lot of it. Uh, in this one, we get another William Gay, which is awesome. I like it. And... Second to last Thanksgiving pack, guys. We're nearing the end. Another William Gay. What else? A Justin Houston and a Tory Smith. This is by far the best pack so far. By far, best pack of the opening. And let's see if we can get even better with the last one and hopefully get an elite Thanksgiving player. I don't think it's going to happen, but that'd be nice. Uh, but no, we get a Matthew Stafford and, and a Tory Smith and a CJ... I don't know how to say his last name to be honest, but I just know he's he's the replacement for Christine Michael in uh, in, the, in the Seattle Seahawks. 
in the Seattle Seahawks, everybody. I don't know how to speak English. But anyways, <laughs> on to the most important part of the opening. We have the 20X Thanksgiving Bundle Topper. Two. Count them two. That's actually four. Two Thanksgiving Elites players. Here we go. We're hoping for 90 plus. 92s would be great. Here we go. We're going to go one at a time. First one we get. An 89 overall T.Y. Hilton. Um, Honestly, probably not one of the best ones we could have gotten, but... He still has decent stats, like really good stats, actually. Look at that, 91 speed, 90 catch, 86 jump could be better, but overall, pretty good card. His, his strength is so incredibly low, 49 strength, that's all right. He's a wide receiver, he doesn't need too much strength. All right, second card coming in. Here we go, please give me a 92. Another 89, Chris Baker. Uh, I'm guessing that that Chris Baker is probably one of the worst ones you can pull. I'm almost guaranteeing that's the worst one you can pull, so honestly... A pretty weak topper, to be honest. Let me look up how much T.Y. Hilton goes for. Um, just because I'm curious. Hilton, not Hilton. Hilton. 89 overall. He goes for a... Hey, he goes for a cool 220k-ish. So right around 220k. I'll take it. Not bad. The other guy probably goes for a little bit less, so... Uh, yeah, I, I'd call it a, a, that a semi-success. We did good. Got a lot of decent pulls. It'll get me closer to Herman Moore, so... I like it, guys. And if you liked it also, click that like button to show some support. And yeah, I'll see all you guys in the next video. Peace out. See you guys later.